All right, now we got one of these accessories and this is the hip belt. So I want to show you how to work with that. In the package, you got the carabiner. So you put it in that eyelet. Okay, lock it in. And now you just take that safety strap and a carabiner and lock it in. That's it. So you got the hip belt anchored to one row or if you need more resistance. So you just take another row put it in and you got that belt on two rows which creates double the resistance right now how to safely use that hip belt you can see there is a plastic buckle in it and it's designed in the way that you step inside the belt or you put it on your body so we can go from the top over the head and now we are inside of the belt so I want you to take that plastic buckle and to lock it in. All right, now what you got? Okay, you can take those straps and adjust those straps and it fits perfectly around your waist. And then you can even without the resistance stay and the belt stays on your hips. All right, what is important is to have that hip belt. It's called the hip belt because we want that belt stay on your head level not on your belly but if it's gonna be on your belly you're gonna have hard time breathing especially when you go in high intensity so we want to have the belt in our hip level so if I turn around you can see it's in on my head sitting right there okay it's pretty comfortable it's a neoprene padded so you can just start right away and do accelerations sprints jumps you can do and work forward you can go and work backwards and also because it's a 360 degree belt you can be sideways and do any lateral movement all right i hope you got that base you got that knowledge Try to apply it, you're ready to rock and roll, and see you in the next one.